paper down on the edges, all the gear upstairs, windows and skylights taped. And we're going to go ahead and prime some of the open trim and then the wallboard as well. So I'm actually changing out my filters on my mask in the attic here. There's nowhere for any of the paint fumes to go or any of the particulates. So um, new cartridges after a couple years um, and then uh, also new, uh, new dust filters after a couple years. So trying to, trying to keep my lungs for two or three more seasons. looks like with two coats of primer on. Got the fan running so that I can get the trim dry so I can sling at least one coat of trim paint on tonight. Uh, it's got a, uh, a one hour one hour wait between coats um, but I think it's going to take a little bit longer because I can't open any, window, any of the windows and I don't have fantastic airflow. So uh, it's going to take a little while longer. So the trim is all painted, uh, I'm going to hit it one more lick just for, there were some drips that we had to take care of. All the baseboard trim is already uh, papered off and taped off, we're good to go. I am going to um, put some sealer on this just because it lived outside for a while and there's, uh, there's lots of repairs on it so that'll make it nice and then since I'm painting and since I'm sealing anyway um, I am going to go ahead and take care of two of the bathroom doors for some cabinets that we have. Uh, my next step after putting this, uh, this last coat of spray on is I'm going to spray the banister there. Um, I have put blocks in and we have filled nail holes and patched holes and all sorts of good stuff. Now the top to it, the, the top railing, um, that'll be stained to match the floor. I wanna get the floor in, which happens next week. I wanna get the floor in first before I try to match the stain. I mean, I know what color it's supposed to be, but I'd really rather have the floor in place so I can get it matched. One coat of primer and one coat of finish paint down, and we're gonna apply the second coat of finish paint right now. Even though there is terrific natural light up here when it's not 9 o'clock at night and when I don't have the windows covered in paint covered plastic, we are putting can lights up here in this ridge. Now I've got all the wire run but I didn't want to cut the holes until after we painted. So what I did was I marked each individual spot where they're going to go with a screw. And when I'm done painting, back with a compass and a drywall saw and cut them all out. And then we'll have LEDs in uh, remodel boxes up in the uh, eave, or uh, it's not really the eave, it's the crown of the attic. So.